Hey, in this short tutorial I'll show you how to create a vacation rental website with WordPress and without any coding skills. If you have a country cottage, a beach house or a gorgeous mountain cabin that you want to rent out without any third-party platforms, then building a vacation rental website may be an excellent option for you. However, even if you don't have any property to rent out, you can still build a niche property rental marketplace to list properties of other owners and make money through commissions. In this tutorial I'm gonna use WordPress, the most popular website building platform, and HivePress, a free plugin for building any type of directory and listing websites. I'll also use the Rental Hive theme since it has all the essential features for building vacation rental websites with WordPress and it's fully compatible with the HivePress plugin. You can follow the link in the description to learn more about Rental Hive, check its live demo or ask developers any pre-purchase questions. Ok, so let's start with the theme installation and navigate to the WordPress dashboard. First of all, you need to install the Rental Hive theme. Go to the Appearance, Themes page and click Add New. Now click on the Upload theme button. Select the theme zip file to upload and proceed by installing the theme. Once it's installed, click on the activate link. Now there is a suggestion to install the recommended plugins, including HivePress, the plugin that powers most of the rental hive features. Proceed by clicking the recommended plugins link and then start the installation. Now Simply click the return link and activate them. Ok, now you can start setting up your vacation rental website. Firstly, it's better to split your website into listing categories to make it easier to navigate. Depending on your website niche, there may be different categories. For the sake of this tutorial, let's imagine that you want to build a vacation rental website like VRBO or Airbnb, where everyone can register and list their property. So, let's add the following categories – houses, cabins and bungalows. Go to the Listings – Categories section to add a new listing category. Here you can name a category. Create a hierarchy of categories, if necessary, by adding a parent category, add a short description and upload an image. When finished, simply click on the Add Category button. By following the same steps, you can add as many listing categories as required for your vacation rental website. Let's briefly add the bungalows and cabins categories. Ok, let's move on. Rental Hive allows you to create your own listing fields and search filters so you can easily tailor everything to a niche. To create a custom listing field, navigate to the Listings Attributes section and click Add New. For example, let's add a price field so hosts can set the price per booking. To do that, simply set the attribute name, allow its front-end editing. Here you need to set the field name used for storing the attribute values and here select the field type. For the price field it's better to use the number type. In this section you can allow users to search and filter listings by the custom field value. Simply mark it as filterable and select the search field type. We recommend using the number range so users can filter listings by the price range instead of some specific price. Finally, you can define how your listing field will look on the front end by assigning it to certain template areas and setting its display format. You can use this display format for the price field. When you finish customizing your custom listing field, 
simply click on the Publish button. Also, keep in mind that in the same way you can add tons of different fields without any limits. For example, you can add the square footage, bedrooms, check-in fields and so on. Now, before moving to the listing submission step, let's extend the functionality of your website. Since Rental Hive is powered by HivePress, it's fully compatible with all HivePress add-ons. It means that you are not limited to the Rental Hive core functionality and can easily add various extra features. To check the whole list of the available free and premium add-ons, go to the HivePress extensions section. As you can see, some extensions have already been packed with Rental Hive and now we have them installed. But let's install the geolocation add-on, so you can integrate your website with Google Maps or Mapbox and enable the location-based search. Simply click on the Install button and activate the extension once it's installed. Then, follow the same steps for other extensions you want to install. In this video, I'll skip the installation of other extensions, since it's the same. However, if you want to enable maps on your website, you also need to set your Google Maps or Mapbox API key. To do this, go to the HivePress settings, integrations section and paste the API key. In the case at hand, we will use Mapbox as a map provider. If you have any trouble getting the API key, please follow the link in the description to check our documentation. Also, it's necessary to go to the Geolocation tab and change the default map provider from Google Maps to Mapbox and save changes. Alright, now it's time to add the first listing to your vacation rental website. With Rental Hive, it's possible to add new listings via the front end and back end, and we'll show you how to do it in both ways. It's as simple as Pi to list a new property via the front end. Simply navigate to your website and click on the List a Property button. You'll be taken to the Listing Submission page and here you should select a listing category, add a title and upload some images. Here you can see custom listing fields. Here is the price field that we have created previously and many other fields that I have created behind the scenes. Also, since we installed the geolocation extension, it's possible to set the location here. So, let's briefly fill in all these fields. Finally, here you can set different booking restrictions and enable the Booking Requests option to accept each booking request manually. When you complete the listing form, click on the Submit Listing button. Now, a website admin, in the case at hand you, should approve the new listing in the WordPress dashboard, Listing section. When the listing is approved, it should appear on the website. Also, if you don't want to approve each listing manually, you can disable this feature in the HivePress settings, Listings, Moderation section. Now, let's add one more listing, but from the WordPress dashboard, so you have a better idea of how it works. Simply navigate to the Listings Add New section. Here, you'll see the same fields as on the front-end listing submission page, 
so you can fill in them in the same way. Next, it's necessary to create a front page and add other useful pages to your vacation rental website. Since Rental Hive is integrated with Gutenberg, you can customize your website layout hustle free using blocks. Simply go to the Pages Add New section. First of all, you have to add a title. Let it be Home. Then, you can start adding blocks by clicking on the plus icon. We also recommend typing HivePress in the block search field, so you have all the HivePress blocks at your fingertips. Now, I'll briefly show you how you can customize this page. Once you are done, click on the Publish button. Now you have to go to the WordPress dashboard, Settings, Reading section, set your new page as a home page and save changes. That's how it works! Now your website has a new front page and similarly you can add other pages like Properties, where all the listings will be displayed a block page if you want to block on your website, and so on. Ok, let's take a look at your home page. As you can see, it already looks pretty nice. However, one important detail is still missing – the header image. To add a header image, click on the Customize button, then go to the Header Image section and upload your image. Now, simply click on the Publish button. That's it! The final touch is done and now your vacation rental website is ready. Please note that I have also added a logo and customized the header menu behind the scenes. It took us only 15 minutes to create this website. However, if you play around with all the settings and customization options, you can create really stunning and catchy layouts for your website. As you can see, here is a location-based search, our categories, and some listings. 
Let's also check one of the categories. Here are our recently added listings with the custom price field we have created in previous tabs and some other fields that I have added behind the scenes. Here you can see different filters including the price one that allows users to filter listings by price and here is a map. If you click on any property listing, you can check photos, bookmark this listing, check a detailed description, check the map, send a message to a host, and of course book this property. Also, users will be able to rate this vacation property, leave reviews about it, and they will be displayed here. Also. Here are related listings. Finally, keep in mind that if you don't need to build a rental marketplace, but need a single vendor vacation rental website, you can also create it with Rental Hive. You can simply go to the WordPress dashboard, HivePress Settings section, Listings tab, and disable the front end listing submission feature. In that case, you can list solely your own vacation property that you want to rent out and nobody else will be able to add new listings. That's it! Thanks for watching our tutorial. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments or you can follow the link in the description to learn more about the Rental Hive Sim and the HivePress plugin. Stay tuned for more tutorials and have a great day!